But Josh V for my country is still wild, man. This, <laughs> this man is already making it clear. He's noticing. He's noticing the trends. He's noticing his eyeballs are clear. He knows that that he's become the standard. Two thirty, two thirty. By Ashake. Now Ashake has been, you know what I mean, on, like again monumental moments last year, doing what has never been done. Okay, we've seen that, we've never seen that happen in the magnitude of an Ashake like run, and to couple that with what is going to be a modern day classic album after that, it's been crazy. Um, he has started the year off already. Um, we've had features, we've had singles. We've had Yoga, that was absolutely a stellar song. This time around, taking it a little bit different direction, sonically, um, being a lot more traditional. And um, we saw that shine through. Um, even though people were ranting, he sounds the same, sound the same. Nah, like, obviously, a Yoga didn't sound the same. Um, and then we had No Competition with um, David. That also wasn't necessarily, a, you would say, I mean, it's people that are not paying attention that would say Ashake sounds the same. So we shouldn't really, really pay that, that much mind. But anyway, Shai, he has his sound, he has his tone, obviously. He has his format that has been influential in the Nigerian music scene. Like down from the crowd vocals to the to the to the violin on on, on production. Shout out to Magic Six that has helped to build his identity sonically as well. So yeah, that's been set in stone, like for sure. And and a lot of people have jumped on that wave. But that's not to say that he hasn't been playful with it. He has definitely been playful with it. Anyway, let's get into it. 230. Let's go, let's go. We're hearing the audio first and we check out the video right after. Let's get it. What am I saying? This is the one with the snippet, right? The tranquility snippet. I think this is it. I think this is it. Let's go, let's go. Shakers are shaking. Facts. I've been the beat of stability. That's a motor battery. Oh my quality, I'll be for my country. You can call me Mr. Money. Mr. Mojo, I should be for my country. That's funny, man. Many, many, better be me, LDP. I call on who's told me. That's facts. Many men wants to be like him, man. I mean, and that's facts. That's exactly what I was saying in the beginning. Um, I think from that, even from that snippet. We, I can't, we can get the hints. Um, I mean, it's not, it's kind of implied that this is a diss track or it, it's, even from the snippet, it's been implied that a lot of people trying to sound like me, a lot of people trying to sound like me, trying to come up and the obvious name that comes up when it comes to like an Ashakea comparison, Shay Vibes. It's very obvious. It's very obvious <laughs> what, is, what he's saying here. He's saying like, there's many people in this country want to, want to sound like me. I, Mojo Ashwari B for my country, meaning like, I've become uniform right now, <laughs> essentially. Um, and I'm just everywhere. And that's... <laughs> I love where this is going, man. I love where this is going. I love where this is going. Hey! It means 230 is about to knock, man. Let's turn up, let's turn up, let's turn up. That was the giveaway, man. What's the what's the chances of seeing a better version of me? Come on, man. With agility, nah, nah, bro. This is straight shots right here, bro. Hey. <laughs> I love to see this side of him, man. Like, no more, no more humility, bro. Like, there's no... Like, we've had it run. We've had the year with him. We've already established who the hell he is. So, he's coming out now to now show and make claim to who... Like, at first, he was humble with, like, oh, yeah, let me... He was saying a lot of, oh, I see I see the potential that I'm having right now. So, let me be... Um, on songs like um, Peace Be Unto You, I was making some into, like, okay, I'm seeing... I'm observing my run right now. So, let me be... Let me be calculated and, and tactful, which was obviously he was moving guidedly by those times. You know what I mean? But now he has come to the point where he seems very established and he has that sense of confidence right now that he's just oozing through the song. You can hear him pretty much call out everybody that like listen, listen, listen. Everybody's trying to sound like me. Like I'm the guy right now. I'm 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 the shit right now. He's just shit talking right now. He's just he's just basically letting these kids know that he's the guy. And essentially, <laughs> essentially that's that's facts, man. That's facts from Ashake's run. 
He's, he did something that hasn't been done before. So he has a lot of, yeah, he has, he has, he has a lot of points to back up with what he's claiming here in this video, with, with this song, man. So I love it. I love it for him, man. And I love, I love that pocket of the hook, man. 230 fell loose. And it's still a ton of anthem. Regardless of all the braggadocious and confidence boosters that he's having here, it's still a ton of record that he's having at this moment, man. Come on. Hey. It's still, it's still very much down the lane of a Magic Six approach. Like it's again, built a sound. They've both built a sound that many artists, many producers now can easily pick up. Like it's easy to pick up. That's why I shout out to Blaze Beats. Blaze Beats is one of those. I mean, he's one of those like really versatile producers. I used to have a mindset that Blaze Beats was very poppy, um, and a lot of his sounds poppy in the sense that like conservative kind of pop, like a Kiss Daniel, like a David O kind of atmosphere. Like, uh, who else? Yeah, Blaze Beats, I kind of do clear gold. The, the safe guys. Essentially, the guys that keep it safe, not really trying to, like, re reinvent the wheel, essentially. But seeing a Magic 6 kind of run that really came and really shifted the sound somewhere else, Um, now to see that Blaze Beats is kind of, like, catching some of the front as well. Like, it's 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 it's, it's awesome to see that. It's awesome to see that, like, that that sound it can be can be very well executed, especially in a Shaka context, man, because this makes sense. Hey! Oh, run that back! Hey! I love that! I love that! I love that! 230 fell through, man. This is a new, this is a new banger, bro. New, new way to open up the year. It's crazy that it's coming a week after Davido's um smash album. Um, so it's nice to see how this is gonna sustain within the noise. Is that Shakir going to come up with another run right now? Are we seeing another run happen? Even though he has, he has essentially not missed on any drop yet he has that every song has connected at least to the point where um it's gotten to the to the to the heights that usually people credit for for songs that are hitting and connecting you know like like a number one on apple music it's still yoga still did um well on turntable charts as well i would assume this would do it amazing as well because yeah because i'm sure this is charting uh, it's hasha care bro i'm sure this is gonna blaze through the charts and blaze through the, even break through the david noise because the david noise is glaring it's glaring. Everybody's running away from dates right now, man. So, uh, yeah, I'm sure this is going to break through the noise. I, I, I'm really sure it's going to do that. You guys are 88% so far on this one. 88% sounds amazing. Um, I should get this in everybody. Exactly, bro. This is coming for everyone's head. But specifically, like, your head will go towards Shady Vibes because he's the loudest of the quote-unquote imitators. Um, quote-unquote, because I, I put that in quotes, okay? Um, cause it's a very, very nuanced conversation around Asha Care and Shea Vibes. But, um, yeah, Asha, Asha, Shea Vibes is the clearing one. Like he was the artist of the year in the first quarter, man. He dominated the airwaves, um, for the most part of, most part of the beginning of the year. Um, so yeah, it makes sense that Asha Care, I, um, that Asha Care might be hinting towards a Shea Vibes rise, right? Um, but anyway, um, what is the comment here? Uh, Song is dope, uh, but prefer more pure log drum sound. What? You prefer more log drums on this? I've never seen someone recommend more log drums. <laughs> I've never seen that. I've never heard that before. That's funny. People usually say, eh, take it easy on that. Um, but anyway, let me run that back. Let me run that back. Um, what's the chances? Yeah, Shady Vibes. Exactly. That's the hint right there. What's the chances for the ability? Yeah, it's it's clear it's clear indication that Shay Shay Vibes is the is the one it's pointing to, man. Um but it's it's been nice to see. I love it for both of them. I love it for both of them. Asha Kerr and Shay Vibes. A whole conversation can be made out of this too, man. Um it's it's glaring what this is happening. It's building a, a rapport for both their fan bases. So their fan bases might be going at it because Shay Vibes has his own his own cult following and um and Asha Kerr is also obviously the everyone loves Asha Kerr, right? So yeah, it would be interesting to see how how this would turn out for for both of them. I think it's good. Go back to the Joe Boy conversation, right? We're just having it. it's going to be healthy for them. I think it's going to be. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be. But this was this was this was fantastic for for Asha Kerr and for Shea Vibes. It's going to be good for Shea Vibes. It's going to be good. But anyway, let's let's actually let's actually check out the video. All right, let's check it out. I should get to that music video. Let's see what he's saying. I know I heard, uh, what's his name? He's not here anymore. TJ Omori. It's probably has been priced out right now, I think. Um, 
All right, like, um, I mean, it's, it's taking upwards of 100 million right now. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Yo, this guy just came to the scene. This guy just came to the scene last year, bro. Last year. Look at look at the branding. Look at what this man is already operating on, man. Like optics wise. He's clear. He's gone. Oh, that's cold. I, I like that that effect on him, man. I just love I love the grainy, the 80s feel to this. This is this is oh, I love that. I love that how the sun is hitting. The board there visuals are visualizing man I, I love what i'm getting so far oh my god this is cold man every frame is fire bro every frame is fire what are we like listen i'm sorry man every frame has been fire right now yes. But Joe, I should be for my country is still wild, man. This, <laughs> this man is already making it clear. He's noticing. He's noticing the trends. He's noticing his eyeballs are clear. He knows that that he's become the standard. He knows that. He knows that he has that effect right now on the music scene. And he's just showing off. At this point, he's showing off. Like, he's just making straight, straight claims that I'm, I'm the guy now. I'm the I'm the standard now. I'm the benchmark. This is it. This is me. It's my moment. Mm -hmm. Hey, that's gonna hurt. Bro, this fire. This video is fire, man. I'm obsessed with this video, bro. Frame by frame, setting by setting, bro. This has been this has been dope. Everything has been clean, bro. Who shot this? I love when they do this in music videos, man. Strip club, okay? This man is hitting long drum on top of your ass, man. I'm here for it, bro. Let's go. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's funny. That's magic. That's magic, bro. Wait, is magic actually on the beat or not? Or is it Blaze? Let me actually check again. Because I saw Blaze beats. But is magic sticks... No, he's not credited. Olamide is obviously has a writing. Olamide is on here for for a writing assist. So that's cool. Um, but yeah, look at Magic Sticks right now and everything, man. I love this for both of them, man. These two, these two changed the game. These two changed the game last year, bro. Impressive, impeccable run. Um, and then Cap bro, it's absolutely impressive what these two have, have been able to achieve in such a short time. And um, yeah, I, I, just, I just love the synergy. I love I love what they represent right now. Like just coming in there and just messing it up, bro. Flipping tables and turning the game upside down. I love it. I love it, man. Let's go, let's go. Let's go into the new year with the banger, bro. Bro, people are going to be singing to this, bro. It's not that club banger, bro. Whoever this guy is captured Ashake's essence to a T, bro. You would think he's tied to the hip of T.J. Omori uh, after, like, him again. T.J. Omori was also instrumental in Ashake's branding, visual, like, like, in terms of visual sense. And Ashake, too, obviously, has some some credit as well to, to, to take on from the visuals of, of his aesthetics, too, man. But um, to see who this new producer or new director, rather, um, trying to capture his essence and in a, in a and I guess in a like this is all sets in, in New York or LA he has that kind of tropical feeling that it feels like LA or something I, his essence was definitely well caught here frame by frame that attitude that charisma that like in your face like the styles of every of every of every drip like it was it was all it was all all captured here like it was all good like this is gonna have this could have been as good as any music video we got from last year, you know? Um, and I love the frame, bro. I love every frame on this. This was sick. This is might be one of my favorites, um, like visuals from Asha Kett, to be honest. Like, especially with the with the with the effects here, you can get like kind of distorted effects you get, especially the paper effect as well. 
look i saw the edits videos to seeing all of that come together like it's it's actually mad it's actually mad um see some like some after effects type type of handwork here you can definitely feel that you can definitely feel that man really creative i love that i love what they did with this video man that was absolutely amazing uh how you guys feel about this video man i didn't put up a poll but still crazy video right like this is this is great this is great how you guys feel how you guys feel how you guys feeling 230 fellow oh my this is gonna be a banger bro the ah no the reach is gonna be wild with this one he's definitely doing it again bro he's doing it again he's doing it again ladies and gentlemen he did it again yet again asha care coming with a phenomenal record and visuals to go with it um yeah man this run is gonna be this guy's gonna be here for a minute man i know a lot of people were like oh it's 2023 is gonna be in question now can he do it was he a fluke can it happen again i think it might i just think it might i think it might happen again guys um yeah i think it might happen again guys i think it's gonna be another monstrous year for him um the debates or if there is even a debate about who the next rated artist is <laughs> come on man <laughs> and bro no one else is in the conversation bro no one else is in terms of brand new artists no one else is anywhere close to to, to him man i think it's gonna be crazy yeah man that was fantastic bro fronts everything about that was was very well put together from the video down to the arrangement of the song itself um yeah captures his essence in a lot of ways and i love the tone how he's moving right now i love the confidence now he's coming out with making a strong claim that yo y'all y'all are biting y'all are biting and i'm here it's okay i'm the standard now i understand i'm the standard and he's accepting that and he's wearing that very well he's wearing that with a lot of a lot of vim a lot of confidence and i'm here for it man i'm absolutely here for it Ashaka, let's go man let's go another round 230 let's go let's go mm -hmm.